Next, we got Gotham Knights preview. So Gotham Knights is out there. Um, Hold on, Jordan. You know me so well. You 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 are one of fifteen people. Oh yeah. Uh, But continue. (laughs) You don't, Hammerite. You don't even have to get him Prince stuff. You could just get him purple stuff, and he'll just automatically associate it with Prince. So, yeah, keep that in mind. (laughs) Uh, Anyway. Gotham Knights has released a preview of characters and we got who was it? We got uh, Red Hood and we got Nightwing. Yeah. Perry, you saw this gameplay. You at the opening of the show you had you had some uh, choice remarks. Uh how do you feel? How do you feel about what you saw from Gotham Knights? So I just rewatched it uh because I think I was caught up in the moment of me moving too fast. Uh, it came out when I was moving with I was with the family and whatnot, so I had to sit there and rewatch it prior to. Um, I have thoughts. I don't like Red Hood anymore. I don't like the fact that he's just a gunslinging type of guy. Not people realizing that Jason has hands. It is. Like, all of them like and he wants smoke and the fact that it's non-lethal rounds makes me feel a certain type of way because ladies and gentlemen if 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 multiverse of madness is really called wanda and black forces any game or movie with red hood is in it is he got black felines on you know what i'm saying <laughs> Yeah, wearing dicky pants in a black t-shirt looking for all smoke. And I mean, the thing is, he's not wearing just any felines. He he wearing those uh those two for eighty nine ninety nine felines. Like he mean business, okay? Business. Like y'all y'all think y'all know what Black Force energy is until y'all saw them them all black, uh, ankle high, two for eighty nine ninety nine black feline energy. Whew. it's it's a different game. Bro, man, and I really feel some type of way about after seeing it. Like Nightwing seems a little bit more interesting, just as far as mechanic mechanics wise, and like um, how he hits. Um, of course, the Court of Owls is always a good story standpoint. It's like you know your own secret society, so that would be great. But man, when I say I'm not excited on Red Hood, he's very bulky. He's not moving like him, and I'm just I'm just not. This game wasn't even a day one purchase for me. This yeah. game, as of right now, I am whelmed. It looked better than it was well. before. <laughs> I love when people say that. Good job. Um, it, it looked better than it what did before. But outside of that, I'm like, I mean, if one of the homies want to do a co-stream, I'll get it on discount when it hits that. But I'm... Personally, I'm not really, I'm I'm not really excited for it, um, and I don't care about the custom mechanics and outfits like that. Um, those are cool, but it's just, I, yeah. I, Jason really just threw me off as of late when I just rewatched it. So, and that's fine. Um, you know, and 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 I am the resident Batman guy here. Um, I'm huge on Batman. Um. And I, and I and I love the Bat family. Like absolutely adore like Batgirl, Jason Todd, Todd Drake, Grace Dick Grayson. Like hell, even even uh Carrie Kelly. Like I love Batman and all of his weird obsessions with child labor laws. Um, but anyway, this is a game that I was initially seriously worried about. Um, because the idea of seeing Batman characters run around and beat each other up and like 
and having the numbers pop above the head. And it was kind of giving Avengers vibes before we knew that Avengers was going to give those Avengers vibes. And I was worried about it. And after seeing this gameplay, I'm not going to say I'm necessarily concerned with the game. Um, but I'm seeing a lot of people that feel like they are sold and I am not like there, like there are things that look cool. I think that, you know, having the melee combat is kind of cool. Am I surprised about it? No. Um, because if you remember anything about this particular line of games, um, Batman, Batman did, uh, in the Arkham, I think it was actually in the Arkham origins game. They actually did like work in some type of like weird multiplayer, mode into it and this is a continuation of that um and i'm just kind of like whatever on it um i hope that it does great i hope that as because they're saying that when they reveal the batgirl gameplay that's closer to like traditional arkham series gameplay and then we also have jason todd out i mean not jason todd but uh I think they said that the uh, other Joker is it. I mean, the other uh, Robin. Did they clarify if that's Damien or if that's uh, Tim Drake? Do we know? No, I haven't. I didn't see anything. Yeah, I'm. I'm betting that it's probably going to be Damien, uh, just because he's been so popular lately. But I don't know. We'll we'll have to wait and see which one we get. Um, but you know, if if they kind of like really like hone in on that these characters are different characters because i did notice that we didn't see any type of counters from um from nightwing he is just kind of doing his like his you know springboard backhands backflips and all of the other flip-flops across the level to like kind of like dodge and move around uh really kind of gave off some spider-man vibes still without the uh, arkham-esque um counter system um Okay, thank you, Ham. So it is, it is Tim. Thank you. Um, so with that, maybe, maybe it'll be a thing like every character just has their own stick, and we will get the Batman counters out of Batgirl, followed by a more of a uh, dodge-heavy system from Jason. I mean, from um, from Nightwing in this particular instance, and maybe Jason is just the long-range character, and we'll see that now that we know Tim Drake. Uh, maybe he is specializing in long range close combat. Maybe he's doing the staff thing because I want to say his uh, Robin more than any other Robin like really leans in on the on the whole staff thing. Um, so maybe we will get a variety and and that'll make it okay. Um, so I'm not necessarily going to say that I'm not I'm not interested in the game. I'm interested. I'm just not sold yet. Um, so. With that being stated, we got time. I got time. We got time. So I want to go ahead because we, we got to apologize to you guys. As again, this is the BLP gift card giveaway. We're going to give away a gift card right now. So in, in the chat, like if you're in the chat and you want a gift card, like give me a gang gang because somebody, somebody that gives me a gang gang is absolutely going to get a gift card, but only one of you. So you got, you got 10 seconds. If if you if you out here ten seconds, authentic Z came in swiftly. <laughs> it wasn't even close. It was swift. <laughs> authentic Z. Look, oh look, oh, gang gang with all the emojis out there. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah, we love to see it. We love to see it. So authentic Z. I'm feeling I'm feeling like Nintendo Switch. Are you are you a Nintendo Switch kind of person? Because I think I got a Switch gift card for you if that if that's who you are and what you've got. Look at that. We're getting the love. So so what I want you to do, Authentic Z, I think I have you on I think I have you on my uh on my on my Twitter, but go ahead and slide in my DMs on Twitter at Dadpad Gaming. Uh right now at Dadpad Gaming. We're gonna go ahead and get this this uh link tree up there. Go ahead and follow me. Uh slide in my DMs. We're gonna get you that gift card with the swiftness. Um, and with that as well, make sure that you follow all of our uh, platforms so that way you can enter in that password of golden on our YouTube comments and our Instagram comments and on our Twitter page where you can win another gift card. So that, that can be you. Maybe next time you need to get that good, good old shiny Xbox gift card. Who knows? 
Uh, but we, you know, we're, we're throwing away money. We're throwing away money. Again, we're giving away over a hundred gift card, a hundred dollars in gift cards throughout the month of May here. So definitely be in those comments pop out because authentic Z while authentic Z has been quiet in the chat, but he came in quick with that gang gang. You know, you got to quit draw McGraw. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. yeah, so let's go ahead and uh, move forward, man. Gotham Knights is coming out. Oh, and did you see that it's no longer coming to uh, PS4 and uh, and yeah, Xbox yeah, One? I, I was just about to say, this is a beautiful showing in which they are going to stop production for a lot of last-gen games and focus on current-gen, which people don't realize this. They did with PS3. I don't know why everybody's panties are in a bunch. It's good to happen. Yeah, we need it to happen. So people, one, don't get overworked. They're not splitting up um, focuses. They just focus on this one thing and get that product pushed out. It's okay. Yeah, Yeah, absolutely. And I mean, and and it and it has to happen at some point. We we want those things to happen. Like the the reality is is. And and going this route, like if you look at the Arkham Arkham Knights game or Gotham Knights, I apologize. Arkham Knights is already a game; it's a really awesome game. Uh, but if you look at Gotham Knights, like it doesn't necessarily scream current. Well, you know, some people still call it next gen, but it just doesn't scream out next gen slash current gen graphics. It does not. Um, so, granted, this game looks the way it does. Uh, and I will say that in some of the gameplay where they were riding on the uh, the bat cycle and on their way to get to, I think it was Mr. Freeze, uh, those graphics looked really impressive. But I did notice when we got that like a year ago, we um, we um, actually ended up having a situation where the game looked really good. Um, and it looks like they've pared that back a little bit because the frame rate in that original video was a little rough. Um, but nonetheless, you know, here we are now, they've paired back the graphics, uh, which is, which is common. A lot of times they probably overshot what they could do with this game. Doesn't look next gen. They probably was, were having issues getting this game to run on PS4 and Xbox one is what I'm assuming. All right, let's see here. Oh no. Authentic Z says that my DMS are locked. I did not know that my DMS were locked. Okay, so I got I got you on the follow. I got you. I see you here. I'm gonna follow you back. I'm DMing you with your gift card information because Authentic Z, you are a loyal member of the Gang Gang Squad. So thank you so much, man, for being being present. And I hope you enjoy your gift card and buy something cool with it. Um, so Perry, where where are we headed from here, man? Mm-hmm. 